Well, folks, uh, I got COVID. Now, I know what some of you are thinking. COVID isn't real. It's like females. They don't actually exist. No, oh, I got COVID. Everyone got COVID. Everyone in the vicinity got COVID. We had an outbreak. A really bad one at that. I'm gonna talk a little bit about that, and uh, I guess uh, a little bit about what's going on, because you spend some a week sick, and all of a sudden the market's collapsing, uh, gas prices are higher than ever, there's no baby formula, apparently, and uh, everyone's wondering, how are we gonna survive? Well, let me tell you about COVID. First off, um, we had a major outbreak. Like, everyone I know, literally everyone got sick. Um... You know, one day I was fine, and then um, I wake up one day with a fever. And not just any fever. It was like the fever. I'm telling you, folks. It was like having your face stuffed into Satan's balls. It was very, very hot. It was a very bad fever. On the initial outbreak, I spent a whole day in bed. I couldn't move a muscle. I couldn't sit up. I tried to stand up. I was dizzy. I had no balance. I had vertigo. I wanted to throw up. So the first day I just spent in bed literally not moving at all. Then after that, the fever kind of went down, but I still ve felt very sick. My stomach was a mess. Even now, I still have somewhat of a cough. Like, it's not over. I've been sick for, uh, I don't even know how long now. More than a week, I've been sick. And, you know, long story short, COVID was unlike anything I've ever experienced. I've been going through these symptoms day after day. It's been different. First it was the fever, then it was my stomach and just this exhaustion of exhaustions. My throat was hurting, I couldn't talk, I was coughing a lot, nearly hacking up lungs, I kept getting nosebleeds. It was bad. But now I feel like uh, my strength is starting to return, I'm still a bit congested, I still do have a cough, but <coughs> hopefully, um, you know, I'm on the up and up. Um, I'm really upset that this happened. And then I got sick because I haven't been able to make videos. Oh, I would say I had a fun time being sick, but let's be honest. It was like getting free tickets to a Mariah Carey concert. Sure, it was free, but did a person truly deserve to suffer like that? Being sick all day and, and, and just not being able to do anything, not being able to work, it is not fun. I did not enjoy it. I hated it. I hated every second of it. And honestly, it, it's, uh, it's unnerving. It's hard to not feel guilty when you, you, you want to be there. You want to be pumping out content. You want to be making videos, but you just can't because you're too gosh darn sick. I, I probably sound a little bit better now. It's because I am getting better. But before, it was just, just bad. Beyond bad, I was bedridden. Ridden. I actually thought I might not make it. That's how serious it was. But, you know, they say that natural immunity is, uh, really good. So, hopefully... Now I'm going to be in better shape. And, you know, I've been watching what's what's been happening in the world. I mean, what is this? I I'm looking here at the news, and apparently Joe Biden is sending baby formula to the border while there's baby formula shortages at the store. People can't feed their children. Now, I don't know why people aren't breastfeeding in the first place, but it needs to be said. Like, come on, lady. Pump those bags. You got a milk factory on your chest and you're not feeding your little baby? Come on, squeeze those bags. Pump them out. Get that milk. <laughs> oh, I, I, know that, I know that there's some women who uh, they have trouble with um, the milk production. Yeah, I understand that's why formula probably exists. I'm just saying, if you can, you should. It's healthier for the baby. It's not only that, you know, I've been looking at the news, gas prices are at all-time highs. Food prices are going up. We have this huge stock market crash, a huge crash and everything. It's like, it's just, it's all falling apart. I'm going to get back to making videos um, soon, hopefully very soon. It's kind of scary to be away for so long, to have been sick, because now I'm worried, like, what is that going to do to me and the algorithm? Is there even a point? All I can say is, um, man... I know there's people out there who think COVID's not real or it's not a big deal, but I gotta tell you, it's, it was unlike anything I've ever experienced. It was bad. I actually thought I was gonna die at some point. Um, I didn't go to the doctor. I, I didn't go anywhere special. I just took vitamins, forced myself to eat food, and here I am, and I'm not dead, so probably getting better, I guess. Anyways, folks, uh, this is just a channel update. Um, yeah. There's way, way too much to talk about. But uh, th there we go, I guess. I'm going to try to get back to it.
Hope you guys are well. Stay healthy. You know, this whole COVID thing was a bit of a wake-up call for me. Um, I want to be healthier. I don't want to get sick again, that's for sure. Anyways, uh, I could blabber here all day. So, uh, see you guys. This has been, uh, Mr. Obvious, and I'll talk to you all later.